If we find a material that can provide a stable voltage of 10 volts for a single battery string, can you win the Nobel Prize in chemistry? Well, certainly. Trust me, you will go down history. Hey friends, thanks for joining me. Welcome to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Will. Come for the lithium battery tips and stay for the humble brag. Increase the single string voltage of the battery, that is, increase the energy density of the battery. Energy density is the most important indicator of the battery. In order to achieve this, scientists have studied this topic for more than 30 years. And recently, various sources said that sodium battery can replace a lithium battery. Lithium ranks third in the periodic table of elements. It's extremely easy to lose electrons in the largest metal elements. So therefore, from the perspective of energy density alone, there's no metal element more suitable for batteries than lithium. However, there are also two disadvantages. One is that the raw materials are so expensive. The other is that its safety is poor. The lithium element is not abundant in nature, which is a rare element. The lithium ore reserves are about 20 million tons, and the lithium concentration is low, and the refining cost is so high. Sodium and lithium are the same group of elements like lithium. Sodium is also very suitable for batteries. In the periodic table elements, lithium is number 3 and sodium is number 11. And they are all in the leftmost row, but sodium is at least 354 times more than lithium, like salt we eat. Absolutely zero pollution. So the price of sodium is much lower than the lithium. It is estimated that the current price of lithium carbonate is more than 160 times that of sodium carbonate, and there's a trend of increase. Having said so much, what are the differences between the sodium and lithium and making batteries? Only in terms of working principle, lithium ion battery and the sodium ion battery are identical, and that is, under certain potential conditions, Metal ions complete the process of draping and embedding between the positive and negative electrons of the battery so as to realize the charging and discharging of the battery. From the perspective of materials, the maximum energy density of lithium is 3.3 times that of sodium with the same unit mass. If measured by unit volume, the maximum energy density of lithium is 1.8 times that of sodium. However, the reality is that the energy density of Li-Fe Pure 4 is about 160 and that of li is about 200. At present, the energy density of the sodium ion batteries has also reached 160 and the gap is not large. It is said that the energy density of the next generation of sodium ion batteries can also basically reach 200. Sodium ion battery and lithium ion battery are battery technology which has developed for more than 30 years and sodium battery technology which has just measured. At present, sodium battery cannot replace lithium battery to become the main strain of power field. But because of the huge potential of cost and technology improvement, it's hard to say who can complete in the future. We will see. If you found this video helpful, likes and subs are appreciated. And see you on next video. Bye.